So the problem's at Daishi Han, and not specifically with the president lady, huh? Gotta admit, that would help explain why those goons went after Rin. But we've already got our hands full with the Synthesters. We don't need to deal with corporate shenanigans on top of that. Oh, hey! Almost forgot I'm totally out of surfacer for my model kits. I'm gonna go buy a bunch. Help me carry it, would you? Oh, don't give me that look. I'll buy you lunch or something. How do you get all this money, guy? Anyways, um... Ye know not what ye have offered. Huh? What are you... Boo, hold up! <laughs> yeah, I don't like the looks of these guys at all. You. You're working with Rin. Who? Us? You will hand her over to us now. Give us her whereabouts. How the hell are we supposed to do either of those things? Don't play innocent. You don't mess with Rin's elite guard. Elite guard? So you are involved then. Hey, I didn't sign up for that. You can't just rope me into these things. This will not be pleasant for you, you understand. Consider it a lesson in obedience and respect. Damn it. Guess we just gotta fight our way out of this one. It's gonna work up an appetite. Hello everybody, I'm a Pigwig and welcome to Let's Play Akiba's Trip. You can follow me on Twitter if you want, at a Pigflake. Okay, she just smacked the shit out of me. Alright, let me fight back now. Ow, ow, ow. Man, the sub quiz took forever to do. But I'm glad I did because I just took a lot of punishment. Ow, ow, ow. The leveling up did help. So you're just gonna dodge everything? <laughs> he dodges somehow. Alright. So if you notice, I'm doing a lot more damage than I used to with my circuit board or my bat by like an extra 200 or so. Not as much as my buddy over here. At least I don't think so. He's doing the thousands. I don't know how. I guess it's the uh, buff he got. Don't want to lose these pants. I lost those pants during the side quest. But I found a store that you can just, well, buy stuff that you lost. Thanks to the uh, all the sub quests I was doing, I actually got to explore around. How did you even counter? I was like nowhere near you for that. And he already lost his pants. God damn it, Kaito, you useless piece of shit. Alright, I think I have enough for at least two characters to die. Or enemies. Ah, crud. I didn't know he was I didn't know one of them was wearing a helmet. Oh, whatever. I guess it's the sunglasses. Oh, a wig. Okay. No, that that's that's legit. I hate that to pick up stuff. It's your attack button, the X button. But at least it's, the X is usually the quickest attack. And yeah, these guys are hitting for a thousand. Never mind. Not my partner. All right. Well, I'm gonna heal regardless. I just gotta look good. And I'll show you the sets to my nice stick once we finish here. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice try, losers. Oh, I guess you were the one doing the actual fighting. Me, I was just doing my best not to get hit. I'm guessing those are the same suits who attacked you before, huh? They've got to have some connection to Daishihan. And they thought we were in with Rin, too. They probably recognized you from that fight where you saved her bacon. I'm thinking maybe Little Miss CEO is telling the truth after all. There really is something going on under her nose. I don't really believe it, but... <laughs> nah, Rin's fans just be crazy. Uh... Yeah, I'll go with this one. Or not. Either way, can we get going already? Yeah, you should probably track her down and let her know what happened. Anyway, I gotta tell you, I don't like this one bit. Feels like Akiba's going crazy all around us. But, 
What can you do, you know? We've just got to keep it together and... I don't know. Keep on keeping on! I guess. Let's head back to Mogra. I'll buy the Surfacer next time I'm out. You're bad with words. You should do some Let's Plays. Uh, shoot. Should I go back to Mogra? You know what, let's read the mail. It's been a while since I've read mail. I have a status update for Battle for Attention, which is a subquest that I did. Regarding your Battle for Attention request, the client sent a reminder. If you don't finish it soon, they're gonna cancel. I know you're busy, but it's best to get it over with. Do it to raise your petition to keep a Freedom Fighters. I already did it, I just didn't read it. So yeah. Also got a trophy. So, from Celis again, where the hell are you? Screw you, I'm done with this. I'm done with that game. It's a piece of shit anyway. It's not like I don't have time. It's not like I don't... It's not like I don't have anything better to do with my time. Well, that dude seemed pretty mad. Uh, if you notice, my phone has a different wallpaper. Uh, I... You can change smartphone wallpapers. So, this is all I have right now. And honestly, I like this one the most. I probably would have gotten with this one. But I really don't like Rin. A oh, fucker, a oh, data beacher. Anyways, show you off the my deluxe night stick. I got a night stick from a cop that was like 19 damage. And all I did was spend a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of money. Holy shit. That's a nice 200 weapon. I spent all my money in the store where I bought a bunch of one handed items, including the ones I already had that were above like at least 12 de attack. And I pretty much fused them all into that. Apparently, you can max up. I think, well, assuming based on the damage, I assume you can max it up to like 9,999 or it could be 999. I don't know. But it has some nice damage. I just, you know. It has a nice steady uh, 400. I was debating if I wanted to use the uh, one handed. If I wanted to upgrade my one handed nightstick or the circuit board or even like the two handed leak she's using. And I'm like, you know what? I like how quick these strikes are and they're very multiple. Or multitudous. So, I mean, I just like attacking a lot. Like, quicker strikes, it has a nice charge of attack. I, I would have stuck with the circuit board, but it only has three attacks, so... It's still not bad. You got attacked by thugs in suits? The ones who were after Rin? I don't know what their problem was. I told them we weren't even Rin's friends, but they didn't care. I think that's your phone. Did you receive a mail? Alright, from Rin, no subject. Come to the Akimari Shrine right now and come alone. Guess I know who I'm fighting with. I had to do something real quick. Sorry. Whoa, whoa, hold up. Where are you off to all of a sudden? Gotta pee, alright? Jeez. Hm. Looks like you came alone. Awfully trusting of you. And so nonchalantly, too. <laughs> Guess I got the right email address. I found it in the data I recovered from Daishihan Pharmaceuticals. Now, why do you suppose that might be? Huh. Uh, because I'm in your fan club? Duh. What? Oh, you are? Well, uh, thanks for your support. Uh, Daishihan does manage the fan club, so I guess... Wait, no! That's completely beside the point. Can you think of any other reason why Daishihan would have your contact info? Maybe a job you applied for by email, which promised rare goods as payment? Oh, I'm quite serious. The email addresses I pulled from Daishihan's records came from the applicants for that very job. I'm sure even you can figure out what that means, can't you? Daishihan Pharmaceuticals and the organization are connected. Now, I couldn't 
tell you why Dai Shihan would be getting themselves involved in all this. But there's no doubt that they are. There's an indisputable connection between them and the Synthesters. All right, so they're in cahoots. Um, so then, what's your story? We're not talking about me right now. Please try to quiet down and pay attention. But uh, I suppose I can at least tell you what I've been hoping to get out of this whole mess. I'm going to purge the Synthesters completely. Cut them off at the source, more or less. Of course, I haven't quite worked out exactly how to do that yet. All I know is Synthesters should not exist. They do not belong in this world. I suppose in that sense, our goals are the same. So maybe, depending on circumstances, it might not be so bad to work with you Akiba Freedom Fighters. But I have two conditions. First, you don't get to ask about my history at all. And second, you can't get Shizuku Tokikaze involved any further than she is. The two of us had a certain connection once. Now, I can't even stand the sight of her. I have information you're going to want. And you know how well I can handle myself in a fight. You can have both, my knowledge and my skills, just by letting Shizuku go. Think it over, decide what you want, and figure out which one of us can better help you. Oh, and this little tidbit is free. Zenya Amo, he's searching for you. By which I do mean the Akiba Freedom Fighters, but also you, personally. Sooner or later, he will find you. You've gotten the better of him one time. Do not let that go to your head. Take some time to think things through, but don't keep me waiting too long. Until we meet again, my little sheepling. Oh no, yeah, I straight up pick Shizuku over you. Any day. Yeah, no, no, fuck you though. Yeah, okay, Rin. I'm glad we had this talk. Uh, I was hoping that hiding the menu, the game would still keep talking, but... I don't know. Guess not. The game's like, nope, we want you to read while you listen, because... Reasons, I guess. So Ren's actually offered to join us, huh? Certainly didn't expect that. She's a multi-talented person fighting to defend Akiba. But asking us to kick Shizuku out of the group? We're still missing too much information. We should ask Miss Kasugai directly about the Daishion connection, I think. I sent a note to her mail address, but she hasn't written me back yet. Yeah, she seems all flighty and free-spirited, but she's still the company president. I bet she's got a lot on her plate. Unlike the owner of a certain game bar I know. Hey now, be nice to your elders. If the Akiba Freedom Fighters want to join forces with Rin, I'll understand. I can chase after the Synthesters by myself. Now hold on just a minute. We've done great together all this time. We can't split up now. Yeah, you can't split up Strip Prism. Um... Plus, Shizuku, you're a dear friend to us all. Thank you. Let's put this whole Rin business on hold for now. It's about time to get out and patrol. Man, I don't know if I can keep my head clear with all this Daishihan organization nonsense. But I guess we've still got a town to save, right? We do. I think we should start in the Yodobashi Camera Plaza this time. Kind of starting to regret why this game is not cross by. I think I would have been playing this on my Vita, but I heard the Vita has some bad frame rate issues. Like the PS3. I know the PS4s and the PC ones are really great though. So, they want to press that, want to press this. I got more mail. Bye from, uh, from Celis again, sorry. Hello. 
It seems I've accidentally... <laughs> it seems I've been accidentally sending emails to you instead of my friend, Hanazono. I'm very sorry for the trouble. Would you please delete the emails I sent previously? Thank you. I would if I knew how. Or if the game let me. Okay, so I guess I was just getting odd emails. I was actually looking for the arcade during the side questing, but I didn't find anything, so that explains why you... This kind of explains why you don't... You didn't see anything from the part previously, the sub part. Anyways, Total Chow Hound. Not your personal blog, who cares? Oh man, people think Twitter is their personal blog, because it is. It's all about venting. Even though this is Pitter, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I'm a little sister like organization. Organization. Okay. Uh, that was an interesting conversation. Not entirely, but it was. Kind of. Alright, up to the Yodobashi area. Uh, I'm just shooting anywhere. Get that damage out. <sighs> this town is filled with stories and music. All tied together by the smiles of those who hear them. I find that way of life to be positively inspiring. But the Synthesters seek to disrupt it. They're the missed note in the symphony. The flubbed line in the play. And I won't rest until they've been stopped. Wow, the last one. I uh, I would be personally annoyed if I said that. <laughs> it would sound like Rob Schneider if I said that. You can count on my help. Look, at that corner. Those are synthesters, without a doubt. Let's go. Looks like I'm messing Shizuku rather well. All right. We fight. Yes, let us fight. <laughs> The meter is almost built, so this should be quick. So, I want to make an op- I made an observation. The girl in the red bow, the blue skirt, and the blue shirt. I'm, I'm wondering if that is a reference to Rukia. I think her name was- or Rukia or Ruki or something like that. Anyways, from Digimon Season 3, I think. The one with the Renamon. I'm wondering. I- I don't know. Because I think she wore a shirt like that. So, I really can't say. Although it's just an observation, I have noticed that there are some games that do tie to, well... Not to each other, but like... They're like friendly terms with like each other, like, oh yeah, you can reference my game in your game. Ooh, cool with that. Um, Soul Sacrifice Delta has some Akiva Surf costumes of... Rin, uh, not Rin, um... I think, actually, Rin and uh, Shizuku. So if you want to wear like, the costumes in Soul Sacrifice Delta, you'll have that there. I swear, it looks like you're snapping their necks when you do that. I was gonna use this, the team power, but I don't think we needed to. Oh, wow, she got eliminated. I'm okay, I got the nice stick. As a, like, like I said before, has a nice charge up attack. But again, I don't want to lose my armor, because then I have to buy it. Alright, two less enemies. You'll be next, buddy. I'm pretty sure your glasses are headward, but I could be wrong. She died pretty quick. AI, the AI doesn't tend to heal as much, like your partner AI. I'm loving this nightstick, it's making this game so much easier. Or this difficulty. It makes it... balance, I guess. Is that all? Be careful. I'm still sensing a presence. <laughs> Found you! I knew if I left enough bait for you, you'd eventually come crawling out from your hole. Zenya Amo. 
You left me in debt to you when last we met. And I've come here to settle accounts. Debt goes against my principles, you see. I hate to owe money and despise owing favors. But the worst debts of them all are debts of pride, and I can't allow this one to go unpaid. Didn't get enough calcium today, huh? I will repay my debt to you in full, this instant. I am no longer the Xenia you've come to know. I have unlocked my inner power to become super... Nay, Hyper Xenia! And Hyper Xenia will not allow the likes of you to stand in his way! Careful. Everything about him is different than it was before. Pathetic ants! Ride in the dirt beneath my magnifying glass and let me watch you burn! Man, am I glad that I see the team attack. I can relate with Xenia, uh... Yeah, Xenia. I was gonna call him Hyper, but no, yeah, I can relate with Xenia. I really don't like being in depth and I don't like going favors. That's pretty much it I can relate with. I don't know about the pride thing. Oh, you just heal it off like that. Like, as soon as you got up. That's cool. That wasn't even telegraphed with the charge noise. Well, I wasted my team attack, so... I guess that's fair. Alright, yours trumps mine's. Fair enough, I guess. Shizuku, please heal yourself. Ah, damn it. That's a nice radius. I have a feeling I'm gonna get that weapon once we beat him. Assuming this is the last fight. Okay, it won't let me. Like, I mashed it. The game didn't let me. So I assume I have to endure him. Or maybe weaken all of his... Uh... Whoa, how did you... Damn. Funny thing is, I was going to try to strip your top. Don't let him heal. Yeah, the game's not going to let me strip. So this is endurance then. If or I have to let it wear off. And I lost my top. Maybe no. It's not always permanently removed. Oh, I wanted to try. Could have worked. Yeah. So I have no idea what to do. Normally in games, you have to use an item to like stop something like that. Then what is going to work, Xenia? I really like the, this attack from the nightstick. You can do it from far away and the enemy won't have a hard time countering it. There we go. But did you really have to take my top off? You think you've hurt me? I barely even felt a scratch! You're lying. Even the original Synthester can't possibly brush off such massive damage. You worthless scum! Do you still think you can stand up to me? I'll tear you limb from limb! No, he can still move. DIE! That's enough! Rin? You think I'd leave something like this for my big sister to handle? Out of my way! What do you think you're doing? Ah! Rin! Why? Why would you cover for us like that? Rin! How could you? 
How could you stand in the way of our ambitions? <sighs> No, my power is reversing, head burning up. What's wrong? You look a bit winded. D Damn you! I can't fight like this. I demand a rematch. If garbage like you thinks it can defeat me, then come to the battle arena and prove it! Consider this my official invitation. And should you turn me down, I'll make sure the innocents of this town take your place in hell. Do you hear me, garbage? This is my royal command! He got away? Uh, sis... I told you... not to get yourself involved... any more than you already were. Rin, hang in there. Tough call. Is she going to be alright? No time for questions now. We need to get her someplace safe. Come on, let's take her back to Mogra. She's got some scrapes and bruises, but I don't see any signs of serious injury anywhere. So, Shizuku? You gonna tell us how you know her, or what? <sighs> Rin... is my younger sister. Right, right, of course, she's your sister. Huh? Wait, hold the phone! She's your sister?! That was an oddly delayed reaction. So does that make her a Night Eater, too? You know, I actually called this one. Just wish I'd have said it out loud. It's like the kind of twist you see on TV. You've got the two sisters at odds, both dealing with some major crisis. And then some bad guy comes in, and they both have to fight him. Really? Uh, Pops, you so didn't call this. Don't even pretend. And wipe that whole smirk off your face. Two little sister characters in the same group. This could pose a danger to our identities, and create a rift in the fabric of reality. No, I'm fairly certain that it couldn't. Six months ago, Rin ran away from home, but she left a note behind. It was roughly 50 pages long, and outlined all her resentment and hatred toward me. It said I no longer had the right to call her sister and proclaimed that she never wanted to see my face again, among other things. Fifty pages isn't a note? That's a freaking light novel! Was it her falling out with you that led her to run away from home? Well... Uh, uh, I think Rin is waking up! <sighs> Rin, are you alright? Thank goodness you're awake. I was afraid you might not ever open your eyes again. Why? I tried so hard to keep you from getting involved. I'm sorry, Rin. I only wanted to know how you truly felt. Sis, I... I'm really sorry. I wanted so much to keep you from getting caught up in my fight. So I wrote all those horrible things. I thought that might have been it. You left me that note so I'd stay away. That must have been very painful for you. I'm so sorry you had to go through that. No, no, I'm the one who should apologize. That was an awful thing for me to do. 
I just couldn't live with the thought of placing you in harm's way. So I thought... I thought... <laughs> Sis, I'm so sorry. Please, can you ever forgive me? Of course. It'll take more than 50 pages of hatred to bring me down. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'd hold that against her if it were me. Yeah, me too. We'll talk more later. For now, you need to get some rest. It's a Kodak moment. Is there anything more beautiful than sisterly love? You're welcome to stay here as long as you'd like. You say that like you own the place. I mean, not like I'm gonna turn her away or nothing. Thank you very much. <laughs> Alright then. I'll take advantage of your hospitality for a while. Um, thank you. If there's anything that video games have taught me, don't trust the sibling that just got introduced. So pop idols can be night eaters too, huh? Truth really is stranger than fiction. <laughs> I'd say they're equally strange. And equally ordinary. Hmm? Rin, you're up and about! Yep. A little R&R &R is all I needed to get my strength back. I feel totally fine now. Everyone here at Mogra has been really kind to me. So, thanks once again. From the bottom of my heart. No, no. We don't need to be thanked. It's the least we can do after you've given us so many good times with your lovely music. Oh, well, thanks for that, too. I'm kind of a terrible singer, honestly, but if you enjoy it, that's good enough for me. Man, it's like this Rin and the pop idol Rin are two totally different people. Indeed, this Rin is far more courteous. That's because as a pop idol, Rin's what you might call a sundere. Hard on the outside, but soft where it counts. Hard on the outside is right. Seems like all her songs are about the frozen moon staining her heart with madness and other screwy stuff like that. <laughs> That's entirely a stage persona. It's all a carefully rehearsed act. It would have to be. The Rin I know is as gentle and kind as can be. Oh, come on, sis. You're embarrassing me. Uh, all this talk of me being gentle and kind and cute and wise. Uh, I think you added a couple. That's why it shocked me so much when you left me that note. Uh, uh, that was an act too. I just didn't want you getting mixed up in my problems. But forget about me for a second. Why on earth, of all people, would you make a boy like this your familiar? Huh? You can only enter into the blood contract once in your entire lifetime. You two are bound by fate now, forever. I mean, you're this elegant young lady, sis. Don't you think you should have chosen someone a little more presentable? <laughs> wow. I like option one and three. I wish there was voice acting for that, you know, aside of me. I got your familiar right here. Uh, how dare you take that tone of voice with me? Rin, this young man has come to my aid countless times already. So please try not to say such hurtful things about him. Uh, sis, I can't fault you for being kind-hearted. If you want to take pity on some wretched low life, that just shows how compassionate you are. Hey, uh, not to break up this touching display of emotion, but you've got somebody glaring holes through you right now. If she doesn't say something, she might explode. <sighs> well, who might you be? Some wretched lowlife's little sister. Little... sister? I've been listening to your slanderous ramblings. Nobody. And I mean nobody is allowed to speak ill of Brody, but me. Well, look at you, cutest thing ever. Ugh. You're nothing at all like your brother. Could it be that he's only your half-brother or some such? 
No. We're definitely blood siblings. Oh, well, thank goodness you got all the good genes. Your adorability is some kind of miracle. I'm gonna pat your head now. Pat, pat. <sighs> Somebody help. I'm... I'm gonna go to sleep now. <laughs> what a charming little lady. Now listen up, minion. Sis may have had some nice things to say about you, but don't let it go to your head. Make sure you know your place and act with all appropriate discretion. If you start to get overly familiar with her, you'll be sorry. Are we clear? So much for gentle and kind. Rin, I wonder if you might tell me now why you disappeared, why you ran away. Greetings and salutations to you all. What's this I hear about the Freedom Fighters gaining a new member? Uh, Shion Kasugai! At ease, Rin. Or shall I call you Ms. Tokikaze? I have no desire to fight you. Uh, then why did you come here? Rin, calm down. Let's hear what she has to say. Thank you, Shizuku. I know you first came to my company because you were looking for something. And I also know there must be a reason you harbor such misgivings about the company now, yes? There is a reason. It's because of the Synthesters who've been terrorizing Akiba. Every time they show up, I search the area, and I always find Daishi Han's track somewhere nearby. Tracks so deep and obvious, you shouldn't even try to deny them. Daishi Han's involved, and that's crystal clear. And that's why you entered our poster girl contest, I suppose. <sighs> so, President Shion Kasugai, are you going to stand there and tell me you have no idea what's going on inside your own company? Wherever there are synthesters, Daishi Han is always close behind them. Hmm. I'm afraid you're only half right, Rin. And the other half is absolutely wrong. Excuse me? The reason I've been playing hooky so much lately is because my company suffered a bit of a coup d'etat, you might say. A coup d'etat? That don't sound good. A particular faction in the office has been fighting to dethrone me. If they take my place, they'll impose their own management paradigm, very different from mine. Officially, they're pursuing research and development for a new medical breakthrough. Well, breakthrough might be putting it too mildly. Supposedly, this new technology can stimulate the human body at the cellular level, accelerating everything from healing time to muscle growth. You don't mean... Please stop talking. I don't. I'm getting Persona 4 flashbacks. Um. I said I'd play this game so it could help me with this stuff, but damn. At least half an hour of this has been talking. Holy shit. Okay. I'm just rambling. Let me just push this forward. So, Synthesis, basically. My, you catch on quick. Now, if I were to venture a guess, I'd say their efforts have been focused on Synthesters' medical treatments. <sighs> Synthesters may be weak to sunlight and prone to violence, but in other ways, they're far superior to the rest of us. Except they operate outside all sense of reason or purpose. To use beings like that for any sort of personal gain is... <sighs> Let's get back to the point. You're admitting Daishihan Pharmaceuticals is connected to the organization. I'm saying it may very well be. Unfortunately, we have no proof. What I can say is that my company has vermin in the walls, and they're constantly scurrying behind my back. Meaning, if Daishihan is in cahoots with the organization, you're not involved, right? That's what I have been trying to tell you, yes. It's a bit of a shame, really. When the Synthesters first came about, I thought I was the first in the company to know anything about them. 
I never suspected that anyone around me could have been involved, let alone behind it all, if that's what they are. I was so busy looking, I missed the answers right under my nose. Always darkest right by the lamppost, huh? Well, coup d'etat or no, I'm still officially the company president. I'll do what I can to clean house and expose whatever threads bind us to this organization. But Rin, I truly would appreciate your help. I want you to continue investigating Daishihan from the inside, just as you have been. I'd have done that with or without you. And don't think I've taken my eye off you yet, Shion Kasugai. For all we know, you're just here to trick us into letting our guard down. Believe what you will. It is my company, after all. Ultimately, the responsibility does rest with me. I believe you, Miss Kasugai. Oh, well, thank you. I'll do all I can to reward your faith with the best information I can find. At any rate, I believe I've told you all I know. If I discover anything useful, I'll be sure to contact you again post-haste. Though I may not be CEO for much longer. <sighs> Shion Kasugai. How far can we trust you? I honestly don't trust her in. She has that Kane complex. You know, from Final Fantasy IV. Okay, so Miss Kasugai's looking into the Daishihan stuff, right? So let's get back to the problem we got. Zenya Amo's still waiting for you guys at the battle arena. He warned us that if we didn't face him there, he'd attack the innocent people of Akiba indiscriminately. The Synthesters are already attacking people indiscriminately, though. What kind of a threat is that? I think what he means is there'll be more attacks if you guys don't hurry over to the damned arena. Amo raised his own power during our last battle. He's not going to make this easy. Then we won't go easy on him. False bravado isn't going to help matters. Our enemy is strong and we need to be prepared for that. Hey, listen. You got this guy cornered and, uh, dogs bite when you corner him. Times like this, ain't no such thing as being too careful. Amo could call us out at any moment. We should go. I want to go too, sis. No, you're staying here. But why? Come on, to the battle arena. But I meant it. He hits us hard, we hit him ten times as hard back. Eh, whatever. I think I've impressed Shizuku enough. Let's just make sure though. Let's see. Ah, damn it. <laughs> but I've been working so hard at woo Shizuku. Eh, whatever. Let's check Pitter and obviously end his part, cause nothing but, nothing but talking. I feel like that's not content to me, but whatever. Radio Kaiken Construction. Why? Takehara, why? These people are weird. They're the only ones who are talking in Pitter. Come on. That, that must say something about them. Anyways, with that literally said by all these fucking characters and done. <laughs> let me pause with Kati. That's it for this part. Let's wait. Keep us trip. Strip. Akiba. Hara. I don't know. I'm exhausted from all that listening. Uh, more like annoyed. Anyways, okay, thanks. Bye.